Monique today is going to do a four station exercise circuit. Uh, basically speed and power, six reps on everything, which is a, a good quantity for reps on this sort of stuff. So she's gonna do squat jumps uh, loaded up with a bean bag, about 10 kilos. She's got a 20 kilo bag there. She's gonna do cleans. And then she's gonna do a single arm twisting pull up and then she's gonna do six clean and press. Okay, we'll just show one circuit, short and quick. Okay, go Monique. Right, now if you're working speed and power, you might have a rest between, in fact, you should have a rest between exercises. Okay, we're gonna simulate a very quick um, two to three minute rest between reps. Um, but Manisha's just going to power through it and, okay. Right, that was handbag cleans, and now we're into the twisting single hand mode on the TRX and making sure she's not going to whack her hand anywhere. So incline lean, twist and pull. Okay. A good way of judging this is if you've got the TRX fully extended and your feet are forward enough, your hands are going to be close to or touching the ground. Okay. We're not quite up a little bit higher there. Normally you would normally have it. So a bit difficult to go all the way down. Okay, so twist, lean to the side, twist and pull. Okay, speed power exercise on pulling. Six each side. Move back a bit, please. That's it. And six of those, six of the best. <laughs> and sideways. So we're pulling up close to the body, flicking the elbows up and quarter squat, stand up straight and punch it up into the air. Well, that was it, three minutes and we're done. Um, again, you'd probably have a bit more of a rest there to get the most out of a speed power workout. Um, don't go punching through it, unless you're training for CrossFit, in which case you <laughs> go crazy, okay? Um, you can have a shorter rest in the in the preseason, um, and we're just because we are working a little bit on work capacity rather than outright performance. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for the next one.